down, up, down, up, down, up. Hi guys, I'm on Pacific, and welcome back to another episode of Perfect Dark. This is the last episode I'm doing, because the boss fight is, uh, less than exciting, and Jonathan is, like, being annoying. Joe with the sassy comebacks. Here we go, we're in the desert. This is gonna be awesome. Get ready. Get ready for this, guys. Ready? Ready? Here we go. Skadoosh! I'm not playing, by the way, it's Jonathan. And immediately flies off. You guys made a big mistake. That's right, Joe, you tell him. Alright, here we go. So this is probably the most easiest mission ever to do this. Yay! Video games, everyone! Here they are! I'm playing... I played a video game, everybody. Here we go. Now... If I wanted to, I believe I can go up. Hey, John. Okay. Big deal. So, anyway, I got the sword here. Gosh, that was awkward. But, I got the sword. And I could support Joe, Institute Squad. Yeah, sure. Okay, so, I got the sword right here. Actually, if you play two-player, the other person spawns over there, but... We're not going to worry about that. We're going to deal with the snippers. Look at this. Oh, you trying to snipe me, boy? I got an assault rifle. Look at that. Here we go. And they, these people got a lot of assault rifle ammo. So, and I'm using the M16, aka the Fah 16. They decided not to do M16. The only gun they actually named correctly, quote unquote, is... The M60, the big machine gun that everyone knows from every video game. Every other gun is some random, like, oh, this is the RCP90 instead of the obvious P90. I'm going to take these guys out with a pistol. There we go, baby. Reload this. Honestly, though, I think this says Walther on the side. No. Yeah, this gun, when you reload it, is freaking it looks like a BB gun it looks like plastic useless completely useless all right there's a lot of dudes with doozies and nothing else going on right now so I'm just gonna do this because I'm on the easiest mode that's why just because this game without easy mode is really freaking hard kind of oh dude John shut up no one cares about you. Does John have a pistol? Or did he actually get an assault? The question is, assault rifle? Yep, John's got a revolver, just like your father, who died because he carried a freaking revolver. I think we gotta go this way. This is actually my favorite mission in the entire game. Not gonna lie. This mission right here is so awesome. There's actually a way to get the rocket launcher, but I don't want to deal with the rocket launcher. Top of the... Oops. Oh no. This is not good. Freaking to punch him! You know what? There, my gosh. So I apparently, I hurt myself with an explosive, aka the Granada. Oh boy, this is intense. This is not actually that intense. Skadoosh! Oh, here we go. Skadoosh! This is actually the proper way to kill them is with the grenade launchers. These riot shielders. Because they get annoying after a while. And by the way, this Fax 16 this is the official Carrington Institute weapon. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but when you reload, if you look at the right side of the gun, it's got the Carrington logo on it. And only Carrington troops use this. So, it's actually kind of weird. Which is also, it's weird because the DEF-12, aka the SPAS-12 with a radar, is really 
it's used by both sides. It's one of the only universal, like, side weapons. Alright, there's a rocket launcher dude over here, and John can actually die from the rocket launcher dude. And it gets really annoying. I believe there's also a flashbang guy up here. Oh no, this is just up here. Alright. Let's go, John. I'm just gonna take my pistol. And I'm gonna head out over here. Where's the dude with the rocket launcher? Oh, I see him. I know where he is. Oh. Eee! Deal with that. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't care, John. I really don't care. You're of no use to me. John is like the most useless character in the game. Jack was better than John because he actually killed people and had less cringy lines and was just a beast all around. John is like. Alright, here we go. This is Carrington, by the way, their little thing. Dang, sounded like he was right next to me. All Freaking all the way over there. Come on. Open it up, please. Pretty boy. Wait, I, I can't see his face. Dang it. Alright. I'm not waiting for anything. I'm directly behind you. You also get ammoed up in this part. Like, the game prepares you for the boss fight. And all the other stuff. By the way, we're doing the boss fight. So that's why I brought the sword. Look at this. Hello, Shrek ripoff and this dude. I don't know why this dude's here, but... Uh, he's, he's talking without moving his mouth. Oh, you don't look very stressed out about it. Carrington's right. You gotta go on without me, Joe. I d he didn't say anything about me leaving you, John. I mean, I'm glad I'm leaving you because you're absolutely useless. But he's like, Joe, go to the bridge. You got only hope. And then he's like, John's like, he's right. I have to stay here and heal up. So anyway, while well, the guitarist actually plays guitar correctly, they recommend you with a shotgun and a submachine gun and or assault rifle. I prefer the assault rifle. Alright, where there should be an armor suit. Hey, there it is. Alright, wait. Is there weapons here? There's, is there FAC? FAC and DWP. By the way, the MP5, which is the DWP5, is actually also used by both sides. Hold the bridge here! Yeah. And this dude right here, one of them, has a sniper rifle that has x-ray vision. And it like shoots through everything. Alright, let's go. So, systematically take out these guys. Someone's got a rocket launcher too, so if I ever wanted it, I could take it. Even though the game does not like processing rocket launcher blasts, which is why it's running at AIDS frame rates. Oh my gosh. This dude is just, he's just chilling. Look at him. Can you stop? There. I freaking... Nice! Dealing with these people easy. I have ammo. Specifically why that dude dies there. Every single time someone dies behind this cover. This is easy, man. Like, I don't remember why it turned on difficulty. I think it was because just one mission got extremely hard on accident. Uh, yeah. I think that's what it was. But, eh, whatever. Let's reload. John is legit sta Sounds like he's standing next to me when he's all the way up in the tower. Like, come on, man. And you also deal with Inviso people here. It's annoying. They're like the tough enemy. Alright. Someone's got some kind of assault rifle of death. Oh, look at that. They got nothing. Watch this. Oh, oh, the teammates actually killed him. It's awesome. There we go, come on. Ugh. Okay, there we go. You wanna go, boy? Look at this. Ready? There we go, got him! There we go, let's go. This is, this is legit. Super easy. On any other difficulty, this thing takes systematic, like, it is the hardest part of the entire game. Like, the boss fight is easy. I beat the boss fight on the hardest difficulty. It's so easy. But it's like, this specific mission is just freaking impossible on harder difficulties. I mean, I've done it before. That was with my sister, like, helping me. And I believe if someone died, you could, like, revive them. So we, we legit just would die and revive each other. So, 
Here we go, ready for this? Ready one more time, ready? I love that. Just going around corners. Oh wow, They're, these teammates are amazing! Compared to John, John is useless. Oh, you can also reload and roll at the same time, which is kind of interesting. Alright, we gotta go, which door do we gotta go through? Blue arrow. I think we gotta go through this one. There's all sorts of weird, like, you can look at Datadyne setup if you wanted to, but... Alright, where's the Inviso people? It's pretty easy to see them. Or is it? Oh man, I'm getting nervous. Oh yeah, they put... Invisible people! Oh, I hate this gun so much. This is legit every time I get to this point on any harder difficulty, I die. Oh boy. I don't know where to go. I think I gotta go this way. Yeah. This way up here. It's beautiful sandbag graphics. 10 out of 10. This game, to be honest though, compared to Perfect Dark, on the N64. Is there so yeah, these guys follow me. It was a disappointment. I'm not even gonna lie. This game is like I don't know. It's just uh, uh, uh no 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 Whoa go Joanna! You'll need to This is the exact same fort that we were in. It's a copy, carbon copy. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I don't care if I shot you in the arm, you're dead. God, I hate these people. They're like, ow! Ah! Ow! Oh, oh, oh no. Alright. Carrying one of these around, man. Skadoosh! Ooh, come on. Inviso time. Ooh, I know they could be anywhere. Good thing you're pointing that out. Ooh. I made a face. I think we have to go this way, right? Ooh. I'm really scared about the Inviso people. Rainbow Six Siege style. Okay, game, stop messing with me. I, did I go in a, oh, uh, I know where to go. Look at it, I'm blinking. All right, I gotta go this way, right? I'm gonna pull out freaking fisticuffs. <laughs> oh my gosh. If, I, if the mission would have ended because I punched that dude, I would have been pissed. Here we go. All right, the final boss fight is upon us. That's Zhang Li's voice, right? Kind of, alright. We get to see... Ah, the music's just like... Carrington? I think we're too late. Uh, yeah, how, how do you know? Alright, let's go. Next mission, baby! Next mission, here we go. Joanna, are you reading I, don't, I don't care about the cinematic. What I will do is keep the same loadout, except I'm going to put in a revolver. Now, using the sword is what you're supposed to do. It's the only way to kill him is use the sword. I think. No, you can shoot him. So I'm going to shoot him. Using the sword is cheating. You can legit kill this dude in like two minutes with the sword. And the boss fight's supposed to be long. Here we go. Uh, oh! Here he is, baby. Beefed up. He looks like freaking God of War. Just like... Oh, oh who's that? Chandra. Yes, exactly, Joe. It's Chandra. The Graal and its power. As promised. Yup. Now, Master, my payment. Miss Sika, my child. You have served me well. But I require <laughs> one more sacrifice of you. This is hilarious. Your life force to the Basically, oh she wants his payment, and he steals her life force. That's legit what he does. That's all Chandra's story is. Jangly, this ends here. I love this cinematic. It's hilarious. You're walking with the Institute now? Carrington was right. You can't control the Grawl. Watch me. <laughs> Here we go, baby. Boss fight. Oh my gosh. This is actually the stupidest boss fight ever. But also the coolest. Here we go, Joe. Are you ready to just completely destroy Zhang Li? There's a lot of thigh shots in this game. Oh. He's got the sword. 
I wonder where we found that. Oops, wrong button. Look at him, he's like running around like a complete idiot. Look at him! He's bouncy! He's so bouncy! Oh, he's shooting balls at me. Here he goes, look at him, he's flipping! This is actually kind of hilarious to watch. Is he going to pick up the column? Look at him. Uh, his animation for that is actually pretty funny. I'm not going to sword him. That's cheating. So he's got the thing up, right? His AI is actually exactly like the AI in um, the game uh, for multiplayer. So now he's sworded me. He actually drops his sword right here. If you don't have a sword. So then it's like, oh, I wonder how to kill this guy better. Come on, shoot him. Uh! This boss fight's pretty easy because I know how to deal with him. Zhang Li! Get exploded, kid. Come on, buddy. He's also got super fast speed. So now, oh, you got hit the second time, you're actually you you are legit supposed to sword this guy. If you don't, you die. Oh no, what's he doing? I'm just shooting him. Like that that's little thing he was doing was he was summoning bodies to throw at you, which in turn gives you like extra ammo. This dude's an idiot. I hate him. And it gives you a P90, so it's like, oh, you suck at aiming because you have no ammo. Right? Alright. Come on. Zhang Li is a retard. Oh, 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 baby. That did no damage. Zhang Li can't do anything. You have wanted me, but I still stay. That's legit. He has the racist Chinese voice. Come on, come over here, buddy. Alright, let's kill him. Sword, 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 sword. <laughs> there he goes! See you later! <laughs> I think I can actually kill him without using the sword, but... For higher difficulties, the sword is in fact required. Now what? Um... Okay, there we go. Are we done now? <laughs> Zhang Li. He's like a zombie. Let me live. No. Sorry. No, not like this. All I wanted, all I've done, I did it so I could live. Zhang Li, you need to die. I have built an empire. I have become a God! An empire's crumble. And yep. the statues of our gods become dust. We're just shadows passing in the... Shang Li is just... Ugh, I hate him. He's so dumb. Stop crying, man. Like, he dies now just on his own. Like, you don't even shoot him. He just straight up dies. I didn't even shoot him! And he's dead. There's Jonathan. Oh no. What's up? <laughs> oh my gosh. The anime, like, the guy's like, <laughs> like, that's legit. His. <laughs> Where did Carrington come from? You okay? I could use an aspirin. So, boss, how'd I do? Perfect. He's a freaking beast of a man. Did you see his hands? They're like a gorilla. He's a gorilla. Anyway, that was the end of Perfect Dark Zero. It's an okay game. I, I like it because it's nostalgic. But, it has a lot of flaws. So, if you enjoyed the series, tell me in the comments below. If you didn't like the series, I totally understand why. 
If you didn't, just tell me all your thoughts in the comments below. Richard Cousins, Lee Schmann, all these people that made the game. I personally think they could have done a lot better. But that's my opinion. Anyway, I don't know what to say. This is the end of Perfect Dark. I'm not sad that it's over, actually. I, it kind of needed to be over. Because it wasn't... It wasn't the most popular series I've ever done, but I enjoyed it. There's definitely worse I could have done. I could have done a lot worse with this game. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode of Perfect Dark Zero. If you enjoyed, tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new because I play other games, not just Perfect Dark Zero. If I only played Perfect Dark Zero, I would not be on this platform very long. I'm I'm Pacific. See you all in the next episode, whatever I decide to make.